up, ladies and gentlemen. Tyler here from Tarbrick I'm at home. And I wanted to hit you with your problem of the day. Okay, we got a good old fashioned multi-step equation. All right, so I'm gonna stop talking. You try to find C, then hit resume or unpause it or whatever the term is. And we'll see if we got it right. Ready, go. Okay, so our goal here is to get C by itself. Okay, so essentially we need to combine our C's and then get everything else to the other side of the equal sign. Okay, so let's do that. First thing we can do is simplify this expression. Before we ever try to go to the across the equal sign, we want to combine stuff that's on the same side of the equal sign. So 2C plus C, we can add together. Now, a lot of kids will be like, when they start algebra, they'll be like, oh, 2C plus C, we'll put those together, There's add those together, there's no number in front of it, so it's just 2C. No. Why would you add something to something else if there was no increase in like the amount and the quantity? So, okay, go to your next class. I'm just kidding. All right, so whenever you do this, any, every time there's just a variable, you always know one times that variable is that variable, okay? We just don't write it because that looks silly. So 2C plus 1C is 3C, okay? And then I just bring everything else down. A very important thing in working multi-step equations, bring everything down. Keep it in rows like or columns, okay? It's going to make it so much easier and you might not forget or leave something behind, okay? I see kids do that all the time, okay? Next, you get C by itself. We need to get rid of what's furthest away from the C on this side of the equal sign. The 3 and the C are like hugging over here, so I've got to get rid of the 12. What's the opposite of adding 12? Subtracting 12. And I've got to do that from both sides. So 3C equals, and then 78 minus 12 is 66, okay? Last step, it's 3 times C. To go across the equal sign, we've got to do the opposite. What is the opposite of multiplying times 3? That's right, dividing by 3. C equals 22. And we have our correct answer. Now, you can always plug that back in and figure out if you were correct. Let's try it. 2 times 22 is 44. Plus 22 plus 12 equals 78. 44 plus 22 is 66. Plus 12 is 78 equals 78. Therefore, it is correct. Okay? All right. Thank you for tuning in for today's problem of the day. Bell ringer, whatever you want to call it. Um, please tell your friends. And uh, that's all I got. Peace. Bye. Hey, Tyler here. Don't forget to subscribe. Check out TarverAcademy.com.